Hello, Dr. Joe here of the drjoe.com and the 2020 forum.com. So there's this popular fruit that we know does have beneficial effects on our urinary tract. What we're not sure of, however, is whether consuming the whole fruit does have any benefits on our heart and our blood vessels. A group of researchers, they set out to answer this very question as to whether consuming the whole fruit does have any benefits on our vascular tree. That's going to be the subject of today's video. But before we continue, just a quick announcement to let you know that I have published a new video in my second channel. The link is going to be in the very first comment below this video. So when you finish watching this video, please go ahead and watch that very video. Now let's continue. Like I said, a group of researchers set out to answer the question as to whether consuming the whole fruit does have any benefits on our vascular tree. And if so, can we see these benefits within two hours of consuming this very fruit? So let's see how it all went. Can this fruit open up your blood vessels? That's what the study authors wondered. And uh, that was what provoked this uh, particular study. So, uh, the fruit in question is uh, good old cranberries, okay? Nice, lovely fruit. So, let's look at the study design. It was a randomized control trial, double blind. We like that. And what the study authors did was they recruited 45 healthy men, split them into two groups, okay? Two groups. The first group, they gave them 9 grams of cranberry powder daily. And that's the equivalent of 100 grams or 1 cup of fresh cranberries. So what this means is uh, this study is not esoteric. It is something that is practical. Uh, you can easily consume 1 cup of fresh cranberries any day. Uh, and the second group, what they did was they gave them placebo powder. And uh, the study authors allowed the study to run for one month. Okay, so that was the study design. What was the objective of the study? Well, the authors wanted to see if consumption of whole cranberries will improve heart and blood vessel function. So that was the objective. And the way they were going to assess this is by way of uh, flow mediated dilation. Okay, this is a nice special test. Uh, and I'll tell you about what uh, flow mediated dilation is. Uh, flow mediated dilation is a test that measures how a blood vessel widens when blood flow increases in that very vessel. So, uh, if blood flow increases in a vessel, does it actually open up or does it stiffen up? Okay, that is what flow mediated dilation is. And indeed, flow mediated dilation is a sensitive biomarker for cardiovascular disease risk, okay? So it's a very nice test that you can do to see how flexible a vessel is, okay? It measures the flexibility of a vessel. What the study authors did in this very instance is that they assessed flow-mediated dilation on day one, okay, at the start of the study, at two hours, okay? Two hours uh, after giving them the powder, and at the end of the study, after one month, Okay, so that's what they did. Uh, they checked on day one at two hours and at the end of the study after one month. So what were their results? Well, what they found was that cranberry consumption significantly, okay, significantly increased flow-mediated dilation. Okay, this is really important. It's cranberry consumption significantly increased flow-mediated dilation uh, at two hours and at one month. Okay. So, fantastic result for them and for us too. Now, the question then arises, why was this experiment successful? There's a simple explanation for that. Well, it's because cranberries are, are loaded with polyphenols. Okay, they are loaded with polyphenols. In fact, the one cup of cranberries that they used in that very experiment had 525 milligrams of polyphenols in it. Not bad. Okay, so when you consume one cup of cranberries, you are furnishing your body with 525 milligrams of polyphenols. Uh, that's a fantastic supply of polyphenols. Dr. Christian Heiss, uh, who was the lead author in that very study, he said this. He said, our findings provide solid evidence that cranberries can significantly affect 
cardiovascular health, even in people with low cardiovascular risk. Okay, so that's a quote from Dr. Christian Hines. Another thing we can conclude from this very study is that the cardiovascular benefits of cranberry consumption are both immediate as well as chronic. So if you add cranberries today, uh, you're going to see the results at two hours after consumption as well as weeks down the line. So this is also fantastic news for anybody who is using cranberries as a lifestyle measure. And this is a study. Uh, it was published in the Food and Function Journal. And of course, Christian Heiss was the uh, lead author. And the title was Daily Consumption of Cranberry Improves Endothelial Function in Healthy Adults, a Double-Blind Randomized Control Trial. So the most important takeaway from this very video presentation is the fact that the cardiovascular benefits of the cranberries came from a dose of cranberries that anyone can consume. We're talking about just 100 grams of cranberries, which is just one cup of cranberries. So uh, we're not talking huge amounts, just one cup of cranberries providing you with nice benefits on your uh, vascular tree. So uh, this is about making small changes that will have a huge impact on your health. So that's what it's all about. So uh, my advice would be the next time you go shopping, if you have cranberries in your local supermarket, just add some to your uh, shopping basket and uh, you will reap the benefits uh, within two hours of consuming them and also in the medium to long term. So what's not to like? In fact, your arteries may just be dancing for joy, just like these ladies uh, in this very video here. There you go. Hopefully you got some value from this very video. If you did, please give the video a thumbs up. Please like the video. And also please uh, share this video with your friends, with your family, with your colleagues. Uh, if you got any questions, any comments regarding this very video, go ahead, leave your comments down below and your questions down below. I think that's about it, but go get yourself some cranberries if you can. Uh, until next time, well, this is Dr. Joe signing out.